Hey everybody, so today I'll be doing a review of my top 10 favorite WC events. So, um, I have them all here, and I guess we can just get started. So, in 10th place, we have 3x3. Three three. So, normally on other people's lists, this would be um, much higher up, but for me, and uh, a lot of people are like really good at it, and I haven't had that much motivation to practice it. Uh, so I'll probably, I ha don't know that many OLO and PLO algorithms, so I'm probably going to learn a few more, or like try to learn at least full OLO and PLO, hopefully by, I don't know when, just whenever. Okay, next we have Skew. So ninth place is Skew, and this is a bit of a shorter event, uh, but I haven't, like the record, I haven't had much motivation to practice it. So, um, so I'm not, it's, it's not very high up on my list because I don't enjoy skew that much. Uh, I average around p five seconds, 5.5 5 seconds. Uh, haven't, much, haven't had much motivation to practice it, so that's why it's not super on my list. Eighth place, we have Pure Minx. Like skew, but shorter event. Uh, haven't had much motivation. Probably gonna learn um, a better method. Um, the method I already use is already pretty decent, but I'm uh, probably going to just try to get a faster turning. I have a ground, uh, I would say, 5.2, so low 5, maybe sub 5 sometimes if I'm feeling good. Um, in 7th place, we have 2x2, two two. so it's a very short event, uh, but the reason this is sort of low on my list is... Uh, it's kind of a bit too short, but um, I, I would say I have decent turning speed. Just my, the method I use is not very good. I use Ortega, and I average around low three seconds with it. Uh, but I'm probably going to learn CLL, um, and that's just to solve the entire um, top layer with only one algorithm. It's a bit faster, but hopefully that'll be better. Uh, now we have sixth place, and this is three by three one-handed. So I actually been I've actually been pretty much enjoying this event a bit more, uh, probably because I've had a lot faster turning. I still use table abuse like this, um, but uh, I'm probably gonna try to start having better turning, like how all the really good people do like that. But I can't do it, so maybe I'll do that later, and I'll hopefully get better at this once I get better at three by three. Average round. 26 seconds, which is a big improvement from like my in competition results. I have like a 30 average. So I like them then. Now we have the top five. So in fifth place, we have five by five. So uh, before this would have been a lot lower on my uh, list because I was pretty slow. I run a bit faster, like a lot faster for me, but probably not that fast for a lot of other people. I average around one minute and 58 i would say on this so not very good um i just need to work on my edge pairing and my centers um but yeah i'm getting i've gotten a lot better like than in competition i average like 20 seconds better than what i average in competition so i'm so i would say i'm pretty decent at this event now in fourth place we have mega minx um, I've also, like, 5 by 5 I've improved a lot of this event. This is actually one of the events I've been working on a lot. Um, I've been dropped, like, a, like, also, like, 20 seconds for my in-competition results. I average around, I would say, one, like, 148. So, a little bit faster than 5 by 5 and I've been enjoying this event a lot more, um, than I used to. And, uh, yeah. Hopefully, I'll do well in competition when competitions resume. Now we have the top three. So, in third place, we have Clock. So, I know a lot of people don't like this event. Um, probably because it's... I don't know why people don't like this event. But I enjoy it, actually, a lot. Uh, I've gotten a lot better at it. And uh, it's one of the events I've been practicing a bit more than usual. So, um, this would definitely... Um, the one of one of the events I practice like um, just for like a lot for a day. Uh, I average around I would say 
10 seconds, like low 10 seconds. So I'm getting a lot better at this event um, than I used to, like in competition. Uh, sometimes I get nervous and I like lock up, but uh, this event, I would say I'm pretty decent at, and I actually really enjoy this event. Now we move on to the top two. So in second place, we have <laughs> four by four. So I actually really enjoy this vid or this <laughs> this event uh, because um, I just recently learned Yao. I used to use beginner's method, which is like <laughs> super bad, but I just recently learned Yao and I'm averaging, I would say around 52 seconds. So I'm getting a lot better now. Um, and I've been, this is also another event, I've been practicing a lot more recently, and I really enjoy this because it's not super long, it's not a super long event, but it's not super short either. So, yeah, this is probably one of the events I would practice a lot, like claw. Um, I really like, um, I mean, really need to improve on my, on my centers and edge pairing and 3x3 three three stage, uh, but uh, this is... Definitely one of my favorite events. Now we move on to my favorite event. And I think a lot of people who know, um, like who know me, um, will know that this is my favorite event. And it is square one. So I practiced this event way too much. Like uh, a lot before compared to like these other nine events. I practiced, uh, I used to practice one so much. Um, I'm trying to get back into it because I've been practicing like Mega Minx, 5x5, 4x4, and Quag a lot. So I'm gonna start practicing it a lot more. Um, I would say I average around, I'm actually not sure. I, <laughs> I even though I'm not like as fast um, as like I should be, um, given the amount of time I've had to practice, um, I still enjoy this event a lot. So I would say um, I average around like mid nine seconds, like 9.5. <laughs> Even though that's like what I averaged like two or three months ago. So uh, I could be a lot better at this and I'm going to probably start practicing a bit more. Uh, definitely a very fun event and um, hopefully more people start doing this event because it's super underrated and super fun. Uh, and yeah, that's basically it for my top 10 favorite WCA events. So I've definitely been um, practicing a lot more recently. Um, and since it's winter break, hopefully I'll be able to practice a lot more and get better at these events. Um, and yeah, and that's it for the video. Thank you for watching.